So this is a pretty challenging and interesting project. I'll just give you a brief rundown. Uh, we are the second contractor brought in on this project. The first one quit at blasting day and created quite a few issues that we've had to deal with um, coming in after the fact. So the house was already here by the time we were called in. You can see the plumbing comes out right there. So that is set, that can't be moved. There is no crawl space or basement in this house. So there's nowhere where we could put a macerating pump or anything to get that over into the tank. But, uh, so then we have to work with the plumbing, which means we had to go super deep in the hole, which means we had to blast. So uh, they already did some blasting before we came in. Then they brought us in we had to do two more rounds of blasting ourselves to get the depth needed for the septic tank. The delivery is on the way so Troy is moving around some dirt right now to make room. Um, the other challenging issue that we've been facing is since this whole area was blasted before everything wants to slough off every time we take a, a scoop out. So um, we do have it right now where we can have one of two tanks dropped. So we've got a two compartment tank and then we have a second pump tank. So we will set the two compartment tank and then we will have to excavate out and work our way back for the pump tank. And then the leach field is gonna be back here, um, but that's the only access for the delivery right now. So we will install that after all the tanks are set, but you can see we had to bring in some pretty big equipment so that we could reach down. This hole is probably, I don't even know, 12 plus feet deep. Um, possibly even more. And unfortunately, we're gonna have to try to finish grade around the tank so that there's not as much coverage over the tank, um, but we should be able to get there. So this is the last day of what has been a pretty challenging project, the last of the hard days, I'll say. Um, so once we get the tanks set, it should be smooth sailing from there.
Roger. Okay, you gotta come back this way first, though. Almost like diagonal, really. All right, now come towards the corner here. Okay, now come this way. Okay, and that way. Yeah, I'm fighting it. Are you? Okay, now just back towards the rock here. All of the pits in that orange square as far that way as possible. Okay, it can come forward a little more. I don't know if you can get it there. Okay. And that's actually not far off from where we need it, honestly. He jumped the valve right there. He didn't come out on the next one. <laughs> I tried to pick it up and go that way just for a little more. Man, yeah, if we could come this way, because what happens is I've got to go under this rock to make my connection. Uh, you know what? It's not bad. Well, if it could go, I mean, if, if it can. Yeah, if we could come this way about eight inches would be awesome. And the only reason, too, is where I come out that side over there, I've got to be able to get into the center of that tank. And we have to stay 10 feet off that property line. Oh, well. Yeah. Does, can it, does it turn more, too, or? Uh, no, I think you'll have it pretty good if you can get it to even. Oh, I did, okay. Mark is our 10 foot off the property line kind of thing. Suck it into your truck. There you go. Still doing it? Yeah, 
Is it also like angled right now though, this far back? Um, a little bit, it still has to go that way a little. We need to come back? We actually need to come back, yeah. I'm just barely inside that red, so. That might help. Sure. Could you come this way just a little? Yeah. Uh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's so close. Which is the inlet? The others? That right there? Oh.
coming from this way a little bit. It looks like it might be off just a little. It's actually, that's perfect that way. Let's see. Let's see if we can get it. That's gold. Are you in line pretty good? Yeah, we got here to the inlet. Are you going to be pretty level or are you going to be, are you, how much are you dropped right there? I think it's going to be about perfect. Just enough for the rubber, you know, to yeah. put the pipe in. Cool. All right.